What's going on everyone? Welcome back into some Anno 1800. We are back here in Escoping where we were in the last episode getting ready to mechanize the island here with everything that we need, which is also going to include redoing all of our farms since I do have uh, farms that are kind of spread around as you can see in these weird little places. Yeah, I've got some weird some weird stuff. Seriously, as soon as I get started, another an explosion. Like, come on now, give me a break. Um, yeah, I've got farms kind of spread around from when we were using the free farm field placement mod, so I am going to be redoing all of that as we get started here. So let's just go ahead and get the first one going, which I'm going to do here with this guy. So this is now going to have 144. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Hmm, you know what? Let's keep it away from the train tracks a bit. How about that? Yep, there we go. So there's 144. A few workforce needed and all those good things. Um, oh, you know, I just thought of something. How much... Eh, Benta does not like me much. What a selfless act of I need to get her up to like 90 to 100. I, should be delighted no. to change the I need to get her up to like 90 so I can go buy another... Um, another island from her, but I don't want to make her too awful mad at the moment. Don't want to make her too mad just yet. Okay. Oh, interesting. It looks like when I destroyed that, it actually did Your take out the extra parts. So that's good. Uh, yeah. Let's get rid of that, whatever that was from. Okay. Another barn. Now, of course, I completely screwed this up last time, and I've put in... Oh, no, he did deliver some fuel. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. He did deliver fuel. Oh, there's trees in the way. Of course there's trees in the way. I mean, seriously, there's, like, trees all up in the way. There we go. Fixed. Can we go that way with it? Right to there? I could simply go to print. Uh, newspaper guy. And I forgot to put that stupid mod back in that makes this happen a lot less because I just, I just can't be bothered with it, to be quite honest with you. That'll work. Okay. Hmm. Okay, there he goes. Now he's delivering it. Uh, just a little note, actually, on that little on that guy right there. The delivering of the uh, fuel and stuff. I was informed that I was actually wrong. You don't have to pause the tractor barns if you get the little bug where they won't uh, deliver fuel. You don't have to pause the tractor barns. You just need to destroy it and rebuild it. Uh, destroy the fuel station, rebuild it, and they will go uh, start delivering it again. So you don't have to actually go through and uh, destroy all your stuff. That was a uh, that was a mistake on my part, not understanding what somebody was talking about when we were t talking about ways to go all about fixing the problem. Okay. Um. Let's see. How are we doing? If I took that guy out, and if I take this guy out, how are we looking here? On the hop situation, we have nine. Lovely uh, North Happing needs six. So yeah, we're we're done on hops already. We have all of the hops we need. We're in the 
But you know, I might. You know what? Let's do this. Kind of. I do kind of want to keep stuff sort of spread out here. Let's go over there with it. Oh, it's outside the stupid range. Eh. Hold on. All right, let's go check and see who we get. Uh, another Gerard Fuchs. Okay, that'll work. You need the warehouse, you do. Uh, so you're literally like right on the edge, aren't you? do it that way and get him in. I'm going to move him over to here, I think. There. Like, seriously, there's no warehouse in range? Ugh. Oh, the trouble I have sometimes. Okay, fine. Let's just do this. Now, is there a warehouse in range? Still none. All right, you know what? Fine. There's your stinking warehouse. Leave me alone. Just take your stinking warehouse. It's just going to go right there. We'll put a uh, another house in. Yeah, maybe not right there. Maybe right here. Okay. Now, let's get all of the uh, farm, the uh, fields and stuff we need. That'll do. Should still be nine. Yes, that is nine. Wonderful. I'm going to move that to there. Okay. Perfect. Now. It's time to get some silos going for the pig farms. How are we going to fit all of that in? Well, let's see. Move him to here. Let's take that out. Let's put that there. I want to put him there. Now nah, that looks a little ridiculous, doesn't it? It looks a little ridiculous. can go there. Perfect. Um, this could go like that. Yeah. Uh, somebody in North Happing. Probably nobody. Yeah, it's a grocer. I don't care about the grocer. Where am I? Okay. Spinning in circles here. Uh, okay, so he was saying that he was out of range of grain. Well, that's easily fixed because I could just bring a grain farm. Let's see, what kind of rain? He does not have a very uh, large radius, though. The festival has ended. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll put him in the middle here. that there. Now let's drag a farm.
right to here. Okay. And then... Bring us a road over to here. Perfect. Okay. Now the only thing is I've got to redo some of this. I may have to move him again. No, that's fine. That one goes to that. that there, move this here, move that over there for a moment. Might help. Okay. <laughs> and yes, I know, I know, I just destroyed that one and then I put it right back. I, I'm aware. Just, just leave me alone for a moment. Oh, and we are actually out of things we need to build over here with. So... That means I gotta go to Cape Trelawney. All right, there is the Sligo. Let's pick up a bunch of this stuff. Send you to the old world. Let's go see who we got at Los Bernaderas. We got a scammer. Me, don't really need you. Okay, let's. Lay these out. Uh, did I move him one too many? I did. Alright. I might not have enough room in here. Yeah, I'm not going to have enough room thought we would, but I was wrong, so let's, now I have seen a lot of people complaining that they hate having to do this, they hate having to remodel their entire city just to make room for some farms and stuff, and I'm like, but it's so much fun, like that's the fun of it, that is the, that is the fun, like, if, if you're not constantly sp trying to reorganize your entire city, it's like, are you even playing, you know? It's all about the constant reorganization. Or in my case, just, you know, moving stuff around because you're like, hmm, that doesn't look pretty. And then people think you're crazy. But it's okay. Okay. That'll work for the moment. Just wait until we get another one, uh, some of the building materials that we need over here. Let's take a look and see how we're doing, though, on... We actually are going to be a little short, just for a few minutes, until we get this all fixed. What are you yelling about? Missing fertility? Oh, crap, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs> The grain farms are up here for a reason. Aha. Grain farms were there for a reason. Dang. I completely forgot about that. Okay. Well. Yeah, I do want to get rid of that. Okay. I completely forgot about that. Yeah, and now he's not delivering oil over there. And he's got a full storage thing of oil. And I'll just wait and see what he does. He might eventually decide to do it. <clears throat> um, yeah, we're still actually low on this. Your ship has returned. All right, there he is. Let's get ourselves some steel and steam motors up here so we can continue building. What else she got in? Potato farms, hop farms, 
An explosion. That hop farm right there is actually just out of range. I wonder if I could get it to be in range. Can't there. But I could ride over in here. You know what? Yeah, let's do that. Let's just move him over to here. Okay. And let's move the flour mill, maybe like... Yeah, let's do that with the flour mill. Swap these around a little bit here. Okay. Swap those around a little bit just to change it up slightly. Okay. Don't even know the random mills over here, do we? No, they're all up here. Good. Okay. I'm just gonna leave him, he's fine. Now, next. Is he here? He is here. Okay. Send you back to Cape Trelawney. Now, let's get... Uh, let's figure out how to get this situated. Problem is, it's a is inspection. yep. That's what I was afraid of. He's not in range of some of those. Okay. I wonder something. Can I? No. I was like, can I move it from one to another without having to build another? But the question to that. Or well, the answer to that, rather, is no, you can't. Alright, I want to even some of this up right here. Not that, this. The people celebrate your leadership. Some right here. Sorry if I'm being kind of quiet. I'm like staring, trying to trying to think about where I'm gonna put all this stuff. There, that'll work. Yeah, and I thought I had some extra uh, tiles of trees I could use to surround it with. Perfect. Too bad he does not want to go deliver any of it. Did he ever bring down here? He did. He finally did bring some down here. So uh, <clears throat> that was another thing of just wait kind of thing is eventually they will bring it down. So uh, newspaper guy uh, that cancels each other out. That's fine. Let's publish that side. Okay, this one up here is most likely, yeah, we're going to need to uh, do something about that. I could move this over here. Celebrate your leadership. Yeah, just move him around. Your ship has returned from its voyage. There we go. We can move him to there. Let's get ourselves a tractor. And attach the farm fields. Lots and lots of grain farms over here. 
Love it. Uh, okay, so he can't reach that one specifically. Not unless I get it down here. How are we doing on grain now? A few sundries. Well, it's going to be like that until I fix all of this. Uh, I need to fix his farms. Yeah. We just have to wait for this guy to decide to go deliver some stuff. How much grain do we have in storage? We have a little bit in storage, not a whole lot. We're, we're right. We, we have just enough, but we are waiting on one, two. He is completely out of range, though. I am going to leave it, though, just in case. Who would decline a match with a uh, no. Now, he is going to produce a little bit slower because he's... They're having to uh, the of a farm it all by hand, and it has a lot of fields to do by hand. Another Gerard Fuchs. Sure, whatever. Okay. So right now, I only have two two grain farms that are going to be supplied. Mm, it's not many. That's not many. Let's change this over to here let's take that out whoops there we go and we'll put a tractor shed on that one as well okay um, I'm going to take out those three Alright, now, let's see what sort of nastiness this is going to try to give me. Eh, it's not, well, I forgot to put three back there. I guess that's not too awful bad. Could be a lot worse. Maybe we, uh... Thought machine to stole me job. <laughs> there. Alright, 266. Now, at some point, hopefully, he will uh, start bringing that uh, oil around. We are producing just enough grain at the moment. We'll have a lot more here shortly. We have plenty of hops, I do believe. Uh, four red peppers. North Happing needed four red peppers, so that is perfect. Yes, I know he is completely inundated, and I just don't care. I just don't care at the moment, because I really don't want to have to destroy this thing and redo it all. I really don't want to. Uh, the red pepper farms. Oh, I'm not really concerned about changing them out they're okay you know and when I say changing them out I mean you know putting the uh, tractor modules on them oh right I was using a different thing for that I'm gonna get rid of all those I think I'm just gonna use the dark green ones Fill a few trees in. Yeah. There we go. Lovely, lovely trees everywhere. Looking nice. Oh, you know what? Let's put a wall around that. Let's put a wall around this guy. Uh, I do. Want, I want to do a low wall. Let's do some corners and angles. There we go. Just a nice little low wall around that, separating it from the farm fields a little bit more. 
Oh, you know, I actually had an idea. Let's do this. Let's maybe bring it over to, uh, I don't know, say to here. Okay. Let's slow things down for a moment. Um, okay. An explosion in one of Let's your toss factories. us a shed in. Maybe a, uh, a water tower. Yeah, let's do a water tower. Dirt mound for fun. Maybe a crate. And another crate. And... Let's do some metal piping right there. There we go. A little... Just a little lot, little yard next to it with some material in it. Uh, we did have an explosion. The fire left ruin okay. Behind. Make sure nothing else has been obliterated. Uh, no, but you do need to unload all some of this timber over here. Good deal. These are all looking good still. Yes, yes, yes. Good. Everybody's happy. Okay, let's just go ahead and just upgrade him at least once. Alright. That will eventually take care of all of that. Did you ever go and deliver any? No, you still haven't. Uh, okay, I hate to do it. I hate to do it! But it's gonna have to be done, apparently. Please tell me I have the materials available. No, I'm out of bricks! Ah, I'm out of bricks. Of course I am. Um, I had a ship. I had a ship sitting around. There, there's... Yeah, that's who I'm looking for. Actually, we're going to let him unload, and then let's grab that, because he's got plenty of everything else. Actually, he could use more windows, actually. Yeah. Okay. Speed this up, and we'll bring him over. Let's just do it manually. I don't feel like waiting. Looks like that oil is full right there. Okay, unload all of that and set you back on course. Now, let's rebuild that fuel station since it's all fixed now. Perfect. And I'm not gonna upgrade him or build any oil storage. You know, this is plenty of oil for this little island right here. I don't need to upgrade it any further. This is all it needs. I mean, I might put one more fuel station like up in this area at some point, uh, but beyond that, I'm not gonna do anything else with it. Okay, the next thing I wanted to work on over here, where's, uh, where's, where's the pig firms? Yeah. This is, this is actually bothering me, like, a lot. <laughs> that was bothering the crap out of me for so long. Let's put some trees right there. Okay, and he is heading over to go get that. Good. So there's two there. There's one up here that I think we can actually get rid of. I'm gonna this police station elsewhere. Yeah, I'm still work right here. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, seriously? I really hate how it always selects that. Let's move the police station, because he was like kind of a temporary thing anyways, just because I was like, oh god, oh god, I'm, I am I have riots in the in the city, things are happening, bad stuff is happening everywhere. 
But it's all fixed now, so I feel comfortable moving him down closer to town. Start. I'm gonna start replacing a lot of these nom trees. I like the nom trees for like the edges, like these cliff edges and stuff, and the edges of rivers. But in town, I'd rather just use the uh, the standard ones and stuff. And you know what? I think he deserves a wall as well. Uh, I think we're just gonna use the same low wall. Perfect. Just a little wall. Separate all of that out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Maybe it's the uh, security for the governor right here. Maybe that's what that is. <laughs> all right. Now he should be delivering all of that juicy, juicy oil. Well, now let's look and see what our grain is way through the roof. Awesome. That is what I wanted to see. I wanted to see it through the roof, which it is now. So I am happy. I am happy. Okay. Apparently there is still something right there. Wheels might help. Three, four, uh, five. Is that? Yeah. Okay, and a silo. Cool. Put some trees in. Call it a day. Lovely. Uh, you know what? That doesn't call for a tree, that calls for a calls for a bulldoze and a well. Perfect. Wait, how are pigs looking? Pigs are at 12 now. I could probably take out some pigs. Uh, photography quest for 14k? Yeah, you know what, why not? Even though I don't, well, I mean, I do need a little bit of money. I mean, I don't need a ton of money. I've obviously got plenty of money. But I did spend about 150 million earlier on rerolls. That was that was fun, let me tell you. That was a lot of rerolls. Ah, uh, give her that farmer. Don't need him. And this madness right here. Let's just go that way with it. There, perfect. Okay. Right, 10, 11. Uh, five. So we got one here. Yeah, one here. All right. And the last one is right up here, which I believe I can actually take out and get rid of that one. Just like that. Perfect. Oh, that was one thing I did notice earlier when I was looking at something, was that we were actually short on work clothes. So we do need some more work clothes. I do have a lot of sheep around here, though. I could boost a sheep farm to tell you the uh, to tell you the truth here let's boost a sheep farm just keep an eye on this really that's all I got to do just to be sure and one more work clothes place um Put it right there, but I don't think I can get it in there. 
can I? Can I get it in there? Nah. Eh, nah, I don't even care. Let's just put it out there. That's fine. Okay, so that will take care of the work clothes situation. Lovely. I think everything is looking pretty good. Um, kind of sitting here debating on this. I think I will boost one of these. Just so we're producing a little bit of extra. Now, of course, again, I placed it down and I'm, I may have to go back and redo it all and it's just going to be annoying, but, you know, I, I'll fix it. I'll fix it if I need to. There. Alright, so that ought to take care of that. Yeah, we'll just wait and see if he ever delivers anything. He may not. He may not ever deliver. Won't know until we try. This thing is way full. An explosion is so one is of that one. Factory. Another explosion. We'll just wait for that explosion to uh, settle down. An explosion in one of your factories. Okay. There we go. Escoping has been mechanized. Awesome! So happy to have that done. Now, I'm thinking about taking the city, and I may expand the city over into this area. Um, explosion. Okay, it's still trying to do that. Let's check the newspaper, dude. Fire, penny farthings, World's Fair bid stalls. Everybody's very upset. Let's try to cover something up. Um, is there another cheap one? 25 is the cheapest. 40. 15. Yeah, you know what? Fine, that'll work. That will work. Okay, so this has been fixed. Nothing else has been destroyed. Good deal. Oh, right. World's Fair. I did deliver the uh, all the materials over here earlier, so let's finish this phase. The last phase needs 300, uh, 300 caoutchouc, 150 light bulbs, and we do need some filaments, which I'm not making enough of, it looks like. But I have plenty over in Crown Falls. Just say the word. Uh, there you are. You're just, you're just my go, you're just my little go-between. Okay, let's take all of that over to the old world. I know that's like way more than what it needed, but we'll just take that little bit over. Uh, we'll go ahead and start that phase and get that rolling. Perfect. The train. But anyways, yeah, like I was saying, I'm thinking about probably taking the city and expanding like the uh, residential area on over here. Um, so many expeditions funded some factories and stuff may move a few more things over here you know benta just reminded me that i've gone hours and hours and hours and not checked any of these so let's check these real quick call of the devil can it be the voice of a child this deep in the jungle it is lucifer of cloven hoof leading us astray let's ignore the devil voices the sailors close their minds and we continue on our way. We've got a new person to check out in Crown Falls. <sighs> Swear to God, give me something I haven't gotten a thousand of already. Pirate hunt. Uh, iceberg, your ship is stranded on an iceberg. What shall we do? Uh, well, let's bombard that prison since we have a huge success chance for it. Ice crumbles and we continue. Another pirate hunt. Oh, it's the Kraken. Oh, figures. I have got to start bringing, I think it's a zoologist or there's a particular, there's a particular one you can bring that I think has a good chance of making it happen, but I don't, I don't have it. We have to just outrun it. One of these days, I'm going to get that 
Dang Kraken. Stupid, stupid thing. The Icy Blizzard. Uh, let's take the fork we passed. Uh, it's not much of a detour, but okay. We didn't lose any. We didn't lose any additional morale, so I will. I will take that. And are you stalled because? No, you're just you're just stalled for no reason. Stop being stupid. No, oh, it's her. I was like, what? Whose ship is that hanging out? You've got a schooner there too, so. Oh, sorry, hit my mic. Yeah, probably gonna expand the city. Move it around a little bit. keep all the farms like you know i kind of want all of this farmland the, the the port city as it were right here and then the rest of it mostly all farmland and everything i mean one of these days maybe they'll he'll get some oil sent over to him why you gotta be stupid why you gotta be stupid oh this is something that i noticed um i was told that the fuel station cannot be affected by anything but as you can see, it is being defect affected by the Department of Labor. So there are a few items that can boost the fuel station's productivity. We thought that nothing could, but a fan uh, and I don't know if this is supposed to be like this. Because we thought that we we were under the impression nothing could boost it. But I know that at least that Faris al Sarami does, and so does the, the Department of Labor. Those two things definitely affect the fuel station so be aware that normally it is one oil well and when i say oil well i am talking about uh, this building here in particular what you create from the oil refinery uh one oil well non-boosted with no boost whatsoever can supply one fuel station because these things make produce at 15 seconds the fuel station produces at 15 seconds um, if you have one of these boosted with some items from a trade union then obviously it could supply more than one but a fuel station being boosted by like a ferris al -Sarami or something is of course going to produce a little bit differently so just be aware of that we i was uh we were under the impression that that was not the case but it is the case so yeah delivery quest of ponchos huh oh apparently i'm already ready to turn it in okay well we got a map of an induit or an inuit village all right let's drop off all these filaments for the world's fair and send you back to cape trelawney again okay so what's next do i want to build or do i want to continue continue on with the mechanizing of everything uh no don't need that one i don't know i still do need to expand down here as well which eh, i could do that Happy melodies spring from and Three looks like you're wanting a university I can give that. And while we wait for that, let's check this. Uh, the arid basin water has dribbled to almost nothing. Uh, let's look for a source of the river. And we found one. Perfect, we have water. Speaking of water, my throat is dry. Oh, much better. My throat was so dry right at that at that very moment Reduction it was stopped. ridiculous this guy actually just needs to be moved like over here to be honest with you let's just take out those workers because they don't really need them um and i am okay actually having him slightly off-centered 
Let's put him right there so he covers the maximum. And then I'm going to put in a Mr. Garrick because this is going to be a bunch of engineers and such. Good. All hands up the ready. All right, they're still upgrading. Botanica expedition. What you got for me? Uh, your chaplain is going overboard with his preachings. Uh, let's discredit him. Ah, perfect. Good job, Drew Dernal. You have not failed me. Let's upgrade all of those guys. Life here is rather static. It's rather static. Random road I had right there. What was I going to do? Oh, that's right. I was going to move the industry stuff over here and move like that over here. That's right. I was like, why did I have that double road there? Right. I was going to move all of that around. Okay. That's fine. I can deal with that later. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Uh, some of these guys right here, I could actually go ahead and upgrade into investors. Give me a nice investor boost of influence. World's Fair Monument is finally almost done. North Happing is becoming the, uh, the secondary center of our great little corporate empire. Which is probably running out of materials as we speak. Yeah. Champagne. Fur coats, actually. You know what? Your method. I could do this. Let's turn off fur coats to them. Where's those investors at? Okay, we already got all of this kind of stuff turned off. That's fine. It's plenty happy. Fur coats will turn off. Uh, let's go check these guys out. I do need to keep all of this, though, because I am going to uh, upgrade a bunch of these guys, like, right now, actually, into engineers. There. Perfect. All right. What well, now? What has that done to everything? I wonder if I turn it back on. How screwed are we? I mean, not too bad. I'm not really worried about the money. I'll leave fur coats turned down for right now. All right, so this is all fine again. This is all great again. Beer is okay. Canned food is. Sewing machines. We do have three. We have one there, one here, and one here. And they are already electrified. And we do have one there. We could squeeze another one in over here somewhere, maybe? Maybe, baby. Maybe, baby. Um, yes. We could. And he's going to get... Soap factory. I have a chef Michael. All hands up ready. Let's just toss in a Faras al Sarami. The oil power plant is like forever right outside the range of everything. Oh wait, no, I'm thinking of something different. Never mind, forget I forget I was talking. I'm just forget I was talking. Um Oh, yeah, that's really about it. Let's check this real quick. We know not people. Love Island. Oh, we got a reward. Oh, we got an expert hunter that I don't need. Continue on. Thank you. What was going on with this particular one? Ironwork stuff, the artisanal kitchen thing, and the sewing machines, and... Oh, okay. Sewing machine. Okay, that's what I need to do then. Actually, let's uh, let's take that out. 
And let's actually move this up here for right now. There we go, perfect. Let's see. Still underproducing ever so slightly. Um, put that up to 50. And then actually I can turn this down to zero again. That'll make them a little happier because we don't need as many fur coats anymore. Okay, that fixed the sewing machines. I'll have to check rum here shortly too. The only other thing it looks like we're low on at the moment we have the devil to face. Steel. Yeah, I'm gonna have to deal with steel. I'm, I'll deal with you guys in a moment. It's like a prison here. Okay. Let's get ourselves another one of it's those a in. Inspection. I think we are going to be short on coal, though. Yep, yeah, I think we're going to be sh a little shy of coal. So we'll do a couple of these to supplement the coal production. Um, oh shoot. He needs workers or he yeah he needs workers okay well that's an easy fix uh where is this at okay let's unload all of this mess and let's grab some of that Bring it down here. We will build a commuter pier. We will fix that problem with not having enough workers. Oh, and it's done. Finish the phase. Lovely. There is our second World's Fair. That's awesome. Awesome. Second World's Fair done over here on North Happing. It is growing. Things are looking fantastic. I am stoked about everything. I hope you guys are too because that is the end of the episode. And it is a great moment. Let's check this before we go. We got ourselves a Santanala painting, an Ammonites, and a diamond. Okay. Let's check everybody else real quick. Go ahead and get these going before we before we quit. I said we were going to quit, but you know, expeditions. Expeditions always take precedent. Deeper you go. Um, let's create your. Uh, let's make our own path. A reward has been discovered in the form of a diamond that I don't need. Continue on in the botanical expedition. Amazons, let a woman do the talking. Good deal. All right. There we go. That's the end of the episode, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the episode. We are uh, forging right on ahead with everything in the Bright Harvest DLC. Getting everything mechanized. Now that Escoping is done, we're going to move on to Crown Falls. Go take care of our grape situation in the next episode. Plus, probably do a little more expansion over in North Happing and get some more. Try to get that island all filled on out and play around with it. And then we will be moving into the new world because that's going to be quite a bit more challenging down there. There's a lot to do in the new world. So hope you'll join me for that in the future. Uh, subscribe if you have not for more content from me. Like and comment down below. And we will see you in the next episode, guys. Take care. You